and today we're looking at the padcaster. This is a aluminum frame with threaded holes at the top here for mounting a microphone or lighting. The iPad fits real snug inside here and it comes with a bracket that mounts on the front going over the camera eye and um, you can mount different lenses on there. And when I first seen the product I knew that it had many benefits and could be used in many different applications. So let me show you a few that I'm going to be using here in the studio with the Padcaster. I'm currently using the Apogee microphone right here. Microphone and preamp all in one. Sounds great. Great for recording vocals and acoustic guitar. And this is a great product, but my goal is to see if I can mic my amp and start making videos using an iPad. So we're going to look at a product made by Focusrite and it's specifically designed for the iPad. And uh, let's take a listen to that product right now. And now we've got the Focusrite preamp. This is the iTrack Solo hooked up to an SM58, just testing it out. It sounds really, really good. And let's take and mic up the guitar amp now. <laughs> And that was a lot of fun recording the guitar. I was really surprised at the quality of the audio. So what the Padcaster has done, it's opened up many applications that can be used using your iPad. And what I like most about the Padcaster is the ability to be mobile. So let's go out and talk to some people and see what they think of the Padcaster. I'm here at uh, one of my favorite stores here in Louisville, Kentucky. Oklahoma Music Center. Let's go inside and see what people think of the Padcaster. What do you think of the Padcaster, man? It's awesome. It's pretty remarkable. It's brilliant. It is. Whoever come up with the ideas is, is a genius. Yes, a very smart guy. Yeah. All right, so what do you think of the Padcaster? I like it. It's cool. I really like the Padcaster. I think it's pretty awesome, too. 